I'm going to report you for blocking these areas. I have screenshots of you coming in and out of the bases. You're going to be reported.
putting a sleeping mat there, cat? Yeah. I already did what I wanted to do over here, lady. I got all your spots. Got him! Yeah, we got problems. I parked here at Dirty You got problems. Yes. Anyways, that's what I said. I got problems. So, um, I'm over here at Dirty Deeds because I parked, um, I parked a blubber here so I can get pipes. But now she's kind of trapped here because they're all surrounding the area. Every time I step out under the cure, they're chasing me and shooting arrows at me and talking about how they report me because they saw me come out of a base. Blah, blah, blah. No, I'm not intimidated by that. By that. No. But I can't exactly leave because they will jump in my car, which is packed full of sheets, pipes, base parts. I can't leave. They'll get in my car. So should I come get you? Um, no, my Jeep, you can't come get me because I need to take the Jeep, which is loaded with parts. Um, yeah, but we could take that later. No, I need to take it now. The car's about to blow up. No, I need to take it now. I need to get it unloaded now. The health bar is so low on it because I don't have any more wrenches left. I mean, our base is, I've been, it's, I'm not finding wrenches. I found maybe three, but I left them at the other base thinking there would be, I would find some on the way, but I didn't find any on the way. So I had to basically come here with the one broken wrench in my hand and I took a lot of damage trying to get here. And then when I got here, I saw that they were here. I was like, fuck. And so I took the cures wrench and used it to repair my car a little bit, but, um, I can't. I can't leave. I need somebody else to physically open up the gate and close the gate with me keeping the car doors locked so that they don't get in there. They're literally, they're on top of the warehouse. They're, they're pulling up on ATVs and you can hear them jumping outside the base trying to get in. Um, I'm pretty much done getting resources here. I deliberately put down another deck right in front of them on the side of the building. Um, not because I'm trying to antagonize them, but I wanted to make, I wanted to see if I can get a deck. You know where we have those, uh, the two little shacks that blocked off the side with the workbenches on top. Do you remember that? Uh, no. You don't remember? Okay. Okay, never mind. Wait, ask me again. Ask me again no, because I've like still you. got work no, in okay. my head. You don't remember. I got work in my head. It's fine. The point is, is I was trying to put something down. And yeah, I gotta go. I gotta figure right, out. I'm gonna, out I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run that way. Well, they don't even know. They don't even know the blubber person is here. They've never seen that person's name. They don't know. They might think it's the cure that leaves because I'm just like a. Well, I'm just like the. You know that jacket. They might think the cure went in there and changed clothes. I just need someone to open and close the gate, and then I can pick them up somewhere. If you're in PV, do not physically run. Is there any way you can like suicide here and we'll go together? And I'll bring you back to that base. Yeah, that, that's a good idea. That's, you know, okay, how did I ever play this game without you thinking for me? Don't be a goofball. Um, <laughs> so what, what we could do is you put your shit in there, you suicide, you spawn here, you open the doors for me and close the doors for me while I keep the doors locked so they can't get into the car. And then, um, well, you just, if you have to run a little distance from me away, or if you have to suicide again and just spawn someplace further away from me, or over at the Viper. Well, I could, I could just spawn right back here again. Yeah, all of our corn and stuff I saw with the cure, it's ready, but I didn't want to sit there and do that with that character. I wanted to do it with my main character, so I quickly came back here thinking that enough time passed and they won't be here, only to find out that there was freshly picked branches and chopped trees all over the place, and I look up and they're on top of the warehouse looking at me watching me 
and following me and hitting me with an ATV. And they, they tried to follow me to the Viper and I had to take some really fucked up route. What I did was I started heading down the street. I went behind, you know, um, at Wake Hills, how cars spawn behind the gas station and everything. I went that way and I found a brand new truck and they followed me. And so I quickly took the battery spark plugs and gas and everything out of the truck and kept the cop car. And then they started following me. I was like, well, I can't go to the Viper this way at all. They're going to just fucking follow me. So I acted like I was going to PV via the radio tower. Like I started heading right through the forest to the radio tower. And then right when I had a place to actually turn, instead of going to PV, I wrapped back around the radio tower, went back towards Ofa Lake, like on the cliff, like sideways on the mountain in the forest. Like I'm driving oh, sideways oh, on the, <laughs> like I'm driving sideways on the radio tower. But heading not on the side that has the dam, I was heading on the side that has Ofa Lake and the other side. And so I got, and I kept stopping my car and turning the engine off periodically like you do to listen and to wait. And I finally ditched yes. them. I finally ditched them. I had to go way past our new base that we built on the gas station roof over there by our base. And then I took some roundabout way, went up in the forest again, stopped the car, and then followed the poison line back to the Viper from the opposite direction. Went in there, repaired the Viper, um, moved the cars that were going to blow up, took all the batteries and spark plugs out because the majority of our cars are all going to be gone within the next 20 minutes tops. So I, I took all the batteries and spark plugs out to salvage them. And then um, I repaired a couple so that we will have a couple, but that took up all the wrenches. And then I took off with him with a junky ass Jeep but I couldn't go straight to the base. I, I didn't want to exit there. So I saw, I followed the poison line from Viper to the very back of Dirty Deeds where that tower is, the guard tower at the end of the road. Um, and I followed it there. Then I went all the way to Runamuck, found a brand new Jeep at Runamuck, transferred my shit, and then came out by Runamuck River by the hotel and then went back to Dirty Deeds and they were still here chopping everything. Like, dude, really? Like, really? Yeah, I'm not on my other character yet, so you gotta let me log out, okay? I'm gonna log out right now. Let me get her on. Let me get her on. Yeah, they're outside right now. They're they're out there. They're building on it. And Diesel goes, Cat, I've already taken over this area. I already got all your little secret spots. <laughs> <laughs>